Latin America and Africa Middle East were the standout performers for beauty personal care performance in 2009. While the global beauty personal care market grew by only 4% in 2009, Latin America's beauty personal care sales grew by 15% as it benefited from strong sales of fragrances, color cosmetics, and skin care. Africa Middle East also had a great year with sales growing by 13%. At the same time, North America, which includes Canada and the U.S., actually saw its value sales decline by 1% as uh, recessionary consumers kept their pocketbooks closed and uh, stayed out of the stores. The BRICS uh, continued to be uh, strong markets for future beauty personal care growth. Brazil's personal care sales are expected to grow by 28% from 2009 to 2014. And China and India are expected to do very well with beauty and personal care sales to grow by 50% in both countries. In addition to the BRICS, we also see frontier markets such as Vietnam and Tunisia and United Arab Emirates poised to do very well. Vietnam is expected to see its beauty personal care sales grow by 38%. Vietnam is expected to grow its economy as manufacturers increasingly shift their manufacturing from China where wages are increasing to Vietnam where wages are still low. And emerging markets are expected to do much better than developed counterparts such as the US, UK, and Japan as emerging markets are uh, showing strong economic growth in general, have younger and growing population and a lower debt burden. So emerging market consumers will have more money to spend on beauty personal care in the future. In this tough economic climate, basics such as deodorants and bath and shower products performed much better than discretionary categories. Deodorants sales grew by 7% in 2009, uh, benefiting from strong growth in Asia and Africa Middle East, as well as the Latin American penchant for using deodorants and body sprays in lieu of fragrances. And even in the U.S., deodorants had strong sales growth as manufacturers recently introduced clinical strength deodorants, which carry prices that are two to three times higher than that of standard deodorants. Bath and Shower products also performed very well in 2009, with value sales growing by 6%. Consumer fears of the H1N1 virus led to strong sales of hand sanitizers.